everybody, Christy here with Scott going back to Sorcerer King for our Wednesday stream. Please remember if you want to get our attention to tag at Stardock in your comment and we'll try to pay attention to you. But I'm pretty engrossed in uh, Scott's game here, actually. I'm so we'll see excited. how that goes. You know, I've, been, I've been holding off. So to recap a little bit, we, uh, we started up a insane 1.2 game. Um, the thing about 1.2 is that uh, when you guys get it, Doomsday Day is going. The Doomsday Meter is going to go up faster. SK is going to hit it harder. Uh, you have a couple of um, additional tools in your belt, mm -hmm. but in general, 1.2 is all about uh, making the Doomsday feel good. Right. Um, and so, uh, what we have to make sure is that it's beatable. <laughs> so That's the important. bar. Yeah. So the the uh, we figure that the the bar that we have to hit is beat a insane game uh, a, on 1.2. Mm -hmm. So that is what we're attempting right now. This is probably my fourth attempt uh, because it is brutal. But um, because of the nature of 1.2 and how you know how fast the Doomsday goes up and how merciless uh, the SK is, you can see all these uh, troops right Ugh. here. Um, you know, it has been it's been a lot more fun. It's it's actually one of my favorite playthroughs right now because you have to uh, utilize everything in your arsenal. I am right. I'm putting up walls. I'm doing all this stuff. Uh, so um, anyways, uh, did you want to do yes. the, uh, the overview? So I in true <laughs> AAR style. I'm going to. Yes. Going to cinematic camera mode. Cinematic camera mode. <laughs> <laughs> I, I wrote this. Scott hasn't heard this yet, and I'm, I'm very proud so of exciting. myself. So be nice. Um, and I'm going to do my best narrator voice, but I don't have that beautiful, deep, rich voice. So you'll have to just stick with what I got. We'll take we'll take a so. fake British accent. <laughs> oh, I, I can do British. I can do that. <laughs> <clears throat> Previously on Sorcerer King, Krogna the tyrant has finally made his defiance to the Sorcerer King known. He has his sights set to the fortress in the northwest while he builds his army to prepare for war. Although Krognar has raised lands around his kingdom to thwart the attackers of the Sorcerer King... Sorcerer... Yeah, see, I did it. <laughs> to thwart the attacks of the Sorcerer King's minions, he is in desperate need of more shards. Having already forged an alliance with Ceresa's legacy, Krognar's attention now turns to a neighboring Paradinian city that needs assistance. Yeah, okay. Can Krognar successfully reach the Paradinians before they are forever lost to the madness of the Sorcerer King? Can he escape his mountainous fortress and gain enough power to storm the Sorcerer King's mighty fortress? Or is he trapped, doomed to watch the world crumble around him while he waits for his own destruction to follow? Find out in this week's episode <laughs> of Sorcerer King! That was awesome. <laughs> Thank we you. We have to package you with every game now. <laughs> hey, okay. I would I'm love that. <laughs> Believe me, I would love that. You can't load your save file yet. I'm still writing. <laughs> Hold on, guys. Wait. So, uh, the, so, yeah, the big thing right now, I've successfully um, fended off the uh, Sorcerer King by raising this mountainous wall. Nice. Uh, right here. I, I cut him off right here. He was able to get almost take that shard out. I was able to defend it. Um, got a shard up there, and and basically we're looking pretty good in terms of like the Sorcerer King encroaching on my lands. Yeah, we're okay. The problem is I am now super landlocked. Yeah, and look and at him hanging around outside. They are of they're your ready place. for me up here. Oh man. Um. So there is the Paradinian city that uh, needs my help. Oh, getting to that is going to be Yeah, so getting to that is going to be quote-unquote fun. <laughs> yeah, um, fun. And then uh, over here, there are a couple of shards that I really want to get to before the Sorcerer King does. Um, I also now have... Uh, oh, wrong, wrong screen. Um, I now have uh, Reduced Doomsday. So every, every 10 turns, as long as I have 100... Mana, I can reduce my doomsday, and I will need to. And your counters are really getting up there too. It so is, yeah, I'm Ooh. only 140 doomsday points off from. You're really uh, pushing it here, aren't you? Yeah, it's it's insane. And you still have like a ton say. of the map that you haven't really explored yet, Correct. or anything. Yeah, I've, I've only allied with uh, Ceresa. Mm -hmm. um, there's yeah, big the big time turtles, and there are, I believe, you can see a hint of where the um, ice ice guys are. I think it's yeah. the frozen realm. Uh, so, 
Ooh, yeti. We're going to get started. Um, <laughs> Scott is really excited, I'm you so, guys. You I've, have no I've idea. I've been thinking about this all weekend. Because <laughs> You guys little, made him wait all week. He waited just for you. Just for so you guys. should all feel special. <laughs> Uh, I am going, th- there's a couple of sovereign skills that I want to get to, so I'm going to play, I'm going to manage my magic a little bit to okay. uh, speed that up. Um, so let's see, uh, sovereign skill. So in five turns, I'll get a sovereign, uh, my next sovereign skill, and then I'll be needing summon ship next turn, uh, which I'm going to use to get across these straits um, and get mm-hmm. that. Hopefully, we will see. Um so, yeah, let's start playing Sorcerer King. Woo-hoo. I'm going to take that, and I will try to talk Level to five. myself as, ooh, five right there. Okay. Um, it is kind of hard to talk and play at the it's same time. so it's hard. Oh, I do have uh, another nice thing. Um, one of the improvements that you can build later on is Destiny's Flame. That's going to bring the Doomsday down by 20. Oh, yeah. Five turns. So that will be. That's uh, going to be a big deal for you. Yeah, that's going to be nice. Uh, so let's get these guys over here. I The big thing that I need from my. Uh, that I need to get from my sovereign tree is just bigger armies. Right now, I can only have uh, five dudes in an army. Oh, yeah. Uh, so leadership one is probably what I'm going to go to force. First, um, and then Enchanted Forge, probably. Because I still haven't used those uh, enchantment pages that oh. are new to 1.2. Oh, yeah, yeah. I want to I utilize those. And uh, the CW says to me, if, uh, he asked if I survived the nightmares about baby go infesting go spiders go living in my attic. And uh, <laughs> I hadn't thought about it until just now, yeah. CW. Thanks a lot. <laughs> Appreciate that. Thanks for the reminder. <laughs> uh, shrink, drain life, mantle of fire, tutelage. Focus. The problem with tutelage is that it uh, has mana upkeep, and I really can't. Oh, it does it? Oh, yeah. Like, one mana upkeep is pretty hard to swallow right now, so I'm going to take focus. Yeah, you don't really have a whole lot of stuff to spare. Yeah. Oh, geez. They they lose that. Okay. That's fine. I uh, got a. Decent question here, actually, while you're hmm. out and about and exploring. Yes. Um, Black Smoke D Max asks, uh, "How do you know how many shards are connected to a particular city? Is this in the UI anywhere, or does that mean all your shards are connected to all your cities?" Uh, wait, Don't let me cancel. I'll cancel. Um, right now, it's it's a little sloppy. Uh, yeah, we need to get that onto uh, some UI in the. That's actually one of the the things on our list for 1.3. Oh, okay, excellent. Um, it didn't make it in for 1.2, but uh, somewhere on here, uh, because you have things like the Archivist, the Onyx Throne, uh, that mm-hmm. feed off of that number. Uh, it's a hidden number right now. Like um, a couple of other numbers really need some. They're, they're time to shine in the UI. That is yeah. definitely one of them. And that's, uh, yeah, right now you just kind of have to know. Uh, but... It will be a better UI for that will be coming in one of the updates. Mm-hmm. Out. Excellent. And then uh, he clar- he asks as well. So they definitely are not connected to all cities then, correct? That is correct. I looked okay. at the I did look at the code recently for a fix a bug and uh yeah, there uh it's whatever whatever this little trail shows gotcha. you is uh you know, is correct. So I think I only have one shard connected to my capital right now. It just goes by whatever's closest. I think that the uh, yeah, and I think that it will change um, if you put a new city down. Uh, those recalculate and re. Um, same thing with resources. Right now, they're technically attached to the nearest city. Um, mm-hmm. I don't think that you get any. Oh, the clay pits and the wheat you get bonuses from. Right. Uh, so. Yeah, we've ta- actually I just got out of a meeting where we were talking about how we there will be a come a day where you can reroute those. Uh, oh, manually. okay, excellent. Um, but not today, I'm afraid. Oh, there's so many bad guys. Kick their butts. <laughs> Kill them. 
Oh, hey, I, I can occasionally them. be ruthless <laughs> when it comes That's to that. That's right. Kind of we're stuff. playing as the tyrant, yes. so we gotta embrace embrace it. Yeah, he said earlier, I want to rescue the Paradinians. Yay. <laughs> I said, why? He says, because they're in trouble and I'm a nice guy. No, you're not. You're Krognar. You can't be nice. <laughs> I'll try. I'll try. <laughs> okay. Shard damaged. Oh, my. This is, this is going to be a Gilmoy really says, tight game. The dotted lines from shard to city on the map doesn't seem to correspond to the bonus that you get. Hmm. And then also adds, promote the shard trail into an entity on the map and let pioneers hitch their wagons to it and drag them around. <laughs> <laughs> it's like the bunny hill. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Okay. Can I take these guys out? Oh, come on. You got to you gotta so, be able to. I know. I'm just making sure. I got to <laughs> verify. I was, I was playing again recently and um, because I don't, because I'm still exploring and experimenting, I was just uh, trying different things, and I cannot tell you the amount of times I like closed my game, restarted yeah. because like oh, I man. did something stupid and died or lost a, a valuable unit that I didn't want to lose. I really hope that 1.2 isn't too mer merciless. I'm scared. Own. So if I come to you <laughs> crying, Scott, you need to fix it for me. Okay, I'll give you because I'm a the build important just, one here. Yes, <laughs> just for you, build. Just for me, yes. I mean, you should holy crap that's what? a lot of hit points oh, oh my <laughs> holy son of a monkey um we're going to just sorry i don't know where that came them. from actually i don't even need them to die it'd be nice but what i need is to get this irksome betrayer over here Ah, uh, Keplin leveled up. He needs to level up because he is yeah. a punching bag right now. Arcane spread. It's really nice. Okay. <laughs> Gilmoy says, my Tandis got hit once. Reload. <laughs> Honestly, Gilmoy, that's not entirely far from the truth when it, when it's me. So um, when when I get in front of, of the screen and I'm playing for you guys, it's you're gonna laugh a lot, yeah. a lot more than you laugh at Scott. You'll laugh at me. Trust me. Okay, it's, it's pretty bad. Speaking of laughing at me, I think I'm gonna go in. Do it. Uh, let me make some. I could make one one glove. Okay. <laughs> this is. I can't. This isn't the right move. This is the problem with insane games. Okay. You can't make one wrong move. And I really worry that fighting these guys is the wrong move. So I'm going to wait. Just do what I do and save and reload. <laughs> I can't do that. I, not, not when it's being recorded. Oh, I guess that's true. So. You have your, your pride to worry about, right? Yeah. It's, yeah. Okay. Da -na -na -na. We got let's a see. boat. So let's get on the boat. boat. We're on a boat. What's nice is once I set up a outpost out there, then I can. Oh, yeah! I'm just gonna pump out pioneers. No. Oh. oh, I could use a pioneer, but no deal, Sorcerer King. I don't trust you, and the Doomsday is about to take over. Oh yeah. Oh, son of a gun. Ah. What the? Oh snap! Scott, you got problems. I do have problems, <laughs> and they're all... You got 99 problems, and the Sorcerer <laughs> King is <laughs> all of them. <laughs> I almost have 499 oh, problems. Okay. Oh, man. It's fine. Five turns there. Dude, are you going to make it five have, turns without that thing two going? Two turns. Holy crap. Yeah. Okay. Well, I'm going to have to sink some mana here. That's no problem. All right. Uh, well, <laughs> that, 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 that that's... <laughs> I could lie to you and tell you that that's a significant <laughs> help, but I'm not sure that it I is. I don't know if I'm going to win. I was Dude. Oh man. Holy. Why am I stop stop? Okay, now I'm now I'm flustered. <laughs> I okay. Let's see. You got a couple of questions here, oh so let's gosh. let's do that I while you're panicking. <laughs> I cannot take Guys, he is now. totally focused. Okay, I'll take questions. I got to wait for <laughs> this boat to come back. Oh, uh, let's see. Um the CW says, or remarks that when you have lots of spells cast on a city, the icons in the top left area of the city view do not wrap. Therefore, you need to scroll to view them all. Um, yeah, we should make those 
longer than I guess. And then uh, Black Smoke D Max asks: Spells that give bonuses while fighting in your territory shouldn't they be taking up an essence slot in your city? I have cast a few and they seem to be working, but they never show up on any cities. I think that may be fixed in one point two. That was gotcha. a bug where um, they were set to. There was some weird data where they couldn't be um, they couldn't be canceled out because oh because they were a player modifier. Oh, that is okay. Fixed. <laughs> gotcha. Okay. Because they were applying some, they were applying a bonus to the player technically, and so the the code uh, was only looking for city based ones to right. There. CW be nice. <laughs> I, I don't even want to know. He, he just says focused on losing. Um, very, very possible. But he also remarks or asks, uh, he says, two weeks ago, Scott said Iron Man mode is coming. I don't remember if you actually said that was coming or if that was just something uh, that was discussed. I think we but, had talked about it. Um, he's um, also asking if a hardcore mode is also coming, which is like Iron Man equals only save on quit. Hard mode equals hero doesn't respawn when killed. That's just mean. <laughs> I think that all Man. of these would be wrapped into Iron Man. Iron okay. Man would basically be, you got one save, heroes don't come back. Right. Um, you know. Holy crap. Yeah. No, that would not be good for me. Oh, oh I don't know what to do. I don't know okay. what to tell you what to do. <laughs> Guys, what should he do? You know what I could do is defend. Yeah, what should I and, do? And and be be helpful. Okay, actually, I could twitch. <laughs> okay, so I set up <laughs> defend borders. So at the very least, I'll slowly be taking these jerks out. Oh, look at um, that! There's a little stack. Oh, of trogs! Friggin' trogs! Trogs are jerks. Get back over here, <laughs> boat. Pardon. Waiting for the responses of. See, they what don't to even do. know what to do. They don't even know. So uh, CW yeah. does say bring the Doomsday counter down top priority. No kidding. <laughs> <laughs> on that, I swear. Definitely to God, on, on that. that. And uh, you should split up your stack. That way, you can fight two groups at once. Says Gilmoy. Do you, Do you have enough power to split I don't up think your I stack? Have enough units to. No, it really doesn't look like you do. I have these. That is one thing that's sort of challenging early on when you don't have the the number of units or the power of units to, to oh split God. off into. I have to last four more turns. Son of a monkey, you're <laughs> you are in trouble, Scott. I'm, uh, it will only bring it down fifteen points. That's fine. That's I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna count the beans. I'm just gonna. <laughs> okay, good. I'm leveling up. That's great. <laughs> Is there anything here that could help me there? CW remarks like. that the advantages that the tyrant gains from the doomsday counter are not worth the strength g gain that the sorcerer king gets yeah, from it. That seriously. may be very true. <laughs> <laughs> very, very true indeed. That is true. Though right now my guys can move super fast. Yeah. One, oh, but I really need the extra. I really need more units slots. Sorcerer King is kind of scary right now, though. I think you'd be moving super fast in the opposite direction yes. that you want to go. <laughs> I haven't even taken out a run lieutenant. Run away, run away. Okay. You guys chill. And actually, there's a... Okay, I'm going to move oh, these man. pioneers away from the <laughs> band of... Bandits. The band of bandits. And Probably a good ooh, plan. I will. D I will. I'll defend my borders. My mana is looking pretty good. Actually, my mana is looking real good. So. Oh yeah, you got a lot of mana. Um, and I'm not really worried about this spell. I, I gotta. Okay, so everything in skill. Uh, let's see. Right all the way that direction. Turn. Yeah. Please don't destroy any more shards. <laughs> I don't think asking nicely is really going to get you anywhere, <laughs> Scott. <laughs> That's this. Oh, no. You said it and there it is. Destroyed shard. <laughs> oh, my gosh. I don't know. I don't know. I don't think so. I think that's what is happening. Kiss of death there. Yeah, that was the shard I was going to get. Oh, no. So he's like hanging out over there, too. 
Yeah. Oh, you are in trouble. So I should start um, penning the narrative for, for your swan you, song. Eulogy? Yeah, start working <laughs> on my eulogy. Okay. Oh, units. Do I have three turns? Oh, man. I don't know if you can hold out three turns or oh, not. I don't think I am. Two pioneers. I'm just waiting for the end game screen to pop up. Okay, Erickson. You get in that boat. You get in that boat. <laughs> oh, my God. Like, all the shards. Is this what we call an exercise in futil futility? It, it feels that way. Oh, man. Oh, man. Yeah. Maybe maybe the tyrant was not the right pick. To, yeah, because um, at least if I were the priestess, I would be able to... Um, heal those shards right yeah because that seems to be the big one of the big problems yes it is <laughs> oh, I'm gonna oh, cry. I'm gonna cry. you were so ready for this i was all weekend <laughs> <laughs> all weekend i was thinking about that shard <laughs> oh and they're still attacking oh me. my gosh a what a bunch of jerks yeah you go as slow as possible boat you guys just get <laughs> off this land. Oh, man. Oh. oh, my God. Oh, crap. Is that it? I think that may be full. Uh, All right. Oh, no. Lost my <laughs> there it is. Okay, whatever. Oh, man. Okay. I don't... All these guys... All those wah, guys are jerks. Wah. All those guys are... All those guys are... <laughs> Look at these. Can we call Come Brad on. a jerk? That's yeah. not very nice. Oh, yeah. I am. To his, I'm <laughs> going to go punch him at Well, you're first. allowed. I'm new here. I, I'm not going to call him a jerk. <laughs> but Brad, if you're right, watching so, this, you are not a jerk. I did uh, not say it. <laughs> let's see. So let's actually see the map. I want to see what the heck was yeah, going let's, on. Let's take a look. So post-mortem... Uh, oh, whatever, Gilmore. He says, wow, I never see that screen. <laughs> All right, so he has so many guys. Holy crap! Oh my gosh! I don't, I don't know if. Impossible. How do you even? I don't know. I don't know. No. <laughs> okay. Oh, let's. See. Okay, so let's let's take that. So, um, the Paradinians did get down here somehow. They made their way down. Yeah, they're here there. To uh to do that there's some scouts down there where is yeah they lost that shard so he was uh, yeah. up here where we thought he was right you took uh, out your buddies first yeah dang that is so many units so what holy report? cow Krog yeah log. Uh, i only had a one out of five threat level these guys are at full health. His combat strength was 2,300. Mine was 100. Oh, my gosh. You want to talk about decima <laughs> decimation, and there it is, man. Okay. There we go. I failed the uh, insane game. So that's our stream. <laughs> <laughs> Um, you know, Scott, maybe next time we should raise the stakes for you. If you if you lose, oh we'll have to actually make you pretty and get you that wig that we talked oh about God, a couple of weeks no. ago. I, I happen to have a large collection of them at home. I would be the prettiest guy next week. Cause <laughs> so next week, next if Scott game. loses whatever he's yeah. playing, then uh, we'll, we'll get him a wig. It'll okay. be hilarious. All right. So, <laughs> so yeah, I guess... Um, I guess so that's now, it. <laughs> I have to figure. I have to figure out how to beat the game on insane. Yes. What? So I'm going to put this out there to the viewers. What? Uh, what sovereign should I play as? I feel like priestess mm -hmm. has um, some tricks up her sleeve when it comes to uh, defending the shards, uh, healing the shards. That's a that's a good question. So you guys tell him what what sovereign do you think he should give um, give a try for insane mode, especially for she, next week. Let's see, but she starts with Keplin, who kind of blows. Keplin is he's yeah, weak. he's kind of. But wussy. I can go for I can go straight for um, 
the recruit hero. Right, get you could. Hero. Man, no is that I, random? Does it just geez. give you a random hero from the? No one I may from the collection. To, yeah. Okay. No one I may need to do is send a scout up here, and block in the sorcerer king. So Let's I was see. blocking myself in, and I think what I need to do is block him in. Somebody uh, has a vote for commander. Commander. The commander. That's the I only mean, person who said anything so far. I would be able to have a larger army then there is that and then of course he has varda doesn't he he starts off with varda, varda. A really nice start. she has a dragon that's that's battle so like, cry, this is my fixation is battle cry is really powerful and yes, yeah she's riding a dragon you can't um, go wrong with that <laughs> oh man yeah this the other hero was all the way over here but oh man uh, if i could have got him oh dwarves hero. i like dwarves okay somebody also says uh cw suggests priestess or commander so maybe going with your original uh, gut feeling. Okay, I'll wait for I'll wait for a few more and then we'll uh then we'll like call it good. Happen. Yeah. I'm just gonna Man, I I was doing so good. You were. I was so proud. Aww. I remember putting that wall up. I remember putting that wall up. Okay. Yeah, he continued to play last week after I left the stream room, guys. Yeah. He was playing for like another two hours or something fun. like that. Oh that loss was rough though. You feel it. <laughs> it's the games that you're yes. enjoying the most that you feel it when uh when you get stomped on okay so oh yeah menu so it really seems like priestess or commander okay is the is the what consensus. do you think it's up to you me your call your call oh boy um chant of vitality would get me uh moving faster away. i'm a little more partial to the commander for the reasons that like you say a you know uh, keplin is kind of wussy and yeah. if you're going to go on insane level you really kind of want a hard-hitting hero right off the bat yeah okay um Just so i mean swinging. i would say commander or somebody did recommend if you take priestess you could um, customize her with one summon and seven enchant books and and give yeah. her varda i mean there is always that you can check that duh you can oh, customize wait, wait, this yeah. what are we doing what are we doing we're we both doing? sitting here like are, we're stuck with what we have. No. Oh my god! Oh, that's right, Scott. Okay, <laughs> cheese. Uh, so yeah, I give her um, customize, and then just um, give her Varda for crying out loud. Well, what? Okay, or Drogon. Somebody says, and I'm gonna take court. This is gonna no, be Varda a, has a dragon. A super whatever Drogon. A super. Uh, oh, you're giving her coercion. Sure. Ooh. Everything. We're gonna. Oh, we're gonna make there this it is. happen. Varda. Chant of yes. vitality or coercion. I don't use a problem. Hypnotism. Uh, uh, you guys changed hypnotism recently, didn't you? No, not yet. No, okay. So it's still, it could be cheesed a little, Uh huh. which I may want to do. Well, okay. I mean, you're uh, working so, on insane level. So, yeah, and let's uh, cast, no, no. Two Some summons <laughs> and then a bunch of enchantments. But I think we're good. Let's uh, wait. Hypnotism or chant of vitality? Hypnotism or chant of vitality? What do you guys I'm think? I'm gonna type it in here too. Because hypnotism, I may if I have enough mana, and I did have quite a bit ma of mana last game. I'd be when able to did our stream cut off? Why is it loading? Uh oh. Uh oh. Keep playing. Somebody's one person says chant of vitality. Okay. Uh that's what I'm gonna Hopefully do. they can still see us. <laughs> uh hopefully the lag's just on my end. World. And we're going to uh parademons. All right. Ooh, here we go. Okay. Strong city. I like pioneers. Yeah. To start off with. So, Good plan. Okay. Um, so we're down in the corner. Oh, and we got some buddies right here. This is gonna right be, there. We're fine. We're gonna we're gonna <laughs> win this. I can already. It's a little early to say that no. already, isn't it, Scott? No. We're good. You do have some pals, like literally right there. Yeah. That's that's helpful. Let's make sure I'm not picking the wrong spot. But it looks like we have. Wah, Let's be friends. The dwarves. And oh, crud. You. Uh oh, is the stream. No, nope, it's not. Let me see if I can. I don't know why. 
It is doing that. Remarks regarding Twitch not working right. Oops. I don't know. Maybe we'll have to wrap that because <laughs> I'm not sure why it's not working. Uh oh. No. I haven't learned how to fix problems yet. I'm still working <laughs> on that part. Pioneer. No, no, da, da, da. At least the rest of this will be available on YouTube for you guys to yeah. see the the remaining bit of it. Well, we'll go for another moment or two while I try yeah, to fix I'm this, sorry, and then we'll play, just we'll I wrap it, <laughs> and we'll definitely get into this next week. I'll write you another stunning introduction. <laughs> <laughs> we won't he he awoke from a bad dream. <laughs> <laughs> it was all a dream. It never <laughs> happened. Nobody saw that. <laughs> Can you hand wave that? Uh, that loss away. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So it looks like it's kind of dead for us at the moment. So we will sign off here, I suppose, and right. uh, call that good. And then next week we'll see how you do with uh, the priestess and I Varda. Think, I think we'll. This is a pretty good spot. I have the frozen realm um, that I'll be able to buddy up with. Uh, their Spider Rider hero is pretty useful. Um, I got a couple of good resources around here. Yeah, I'm feeling good. Awesome. So I'll save that. And then... All right. Well, thank you, everybody, for watching. Uh, don't forget that Galsiv is this Friday at 3 o'clock with Paul and Kristen, since I will not be here. And uh, we will see you guys then, hopefully. Thank you. See you guys.